Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to use the external storage uh, on your Galaxy Note 5. As you guys already know that the Note 5 uh, does not have this um, external storage option. I mean the SD card capabilities. Uh, Samsung had made this device premium. Uh, as you can see we got no port for the SD card. Uh, but you can still use the uh, external storage SD card or any USB. Uh, all you need to do is you need to buy this OTG cable. Um, this OTG cable will allow you to use the, um, the the USB into this port. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you here. So this doesn't require any root or anything like that. It will work without any problem. So as you can see that I have inserted the um, the USB cable here. This USB port. So OTG means on the go. And now I will insert my SD card so I'm not gonna insert it like this because it's not possible so I have my card reader here so uh, I'm just gonna insert it insert this one into the card reader and as you can see this is the normal USB port that I will trigger here so I'm just gonna do this here we go and as you can see the light is on and and as you can see the note 5 instantly detects uh, that it, that it external storage has been mounted and it says USB storage A and I can see all my files I can uh, play videos on this phone um, okay I can I can play videos uh, on this um, of, of my USB storage I can also uh, play music I can also copy stuff so as you can see uh, there is no problem with the speed or anything like that I'm just gonna go here and I'm gonna just grab a photo uh, for example this one and I want as you can see I got photos uh, uh, select option I can select all of them I can share them delete so this is a really nice files application you don't need to download ES file explorer from the Play Store the default file manager that comes with Samsung phone will work just fine with this um, with, the, with your external drive or memory card or whatever you are you have mounted so you can copy anything you want to like if I click on share uh, I can save it to my drive or on my on my phone's gallery so everything is possible no problem whatsoever so like I said you don't need to do anything on the settings it's just um, it's just uh, something that will happen on its own so you don't need to do anything so that's pretty nice I can uh, I can just select and then I can click on more and as you can see I got options to uh, move copy or add shortcut to home screen I can even compress that or if I don't need to copy anything I can just uh, quickly play it from there so that's pretty nice if you have a Galaxy Note 5 if you're running short on storage you can use the ODG cable that's pretty awesome that's pretty convenient uh, I mean if you if you if you can't put like a, like a big movie uh, on your phone uh, phones internal memory then you can uh, use this um, this external option and you can play a movie you can also uh, play songs and all that uh, it's all fun you know you can do all sorts of stuff so that's a pretty convenient way to use external storage on the note 5 even though it doesn't have the SD card sport that the note 4 had so yeah if this video helps you out make sure you give this video a thumbs up please share this video subscribe like comment and I'll see you guys in the next one peace out